Hi everyone, I'm Serge Marin, the founder and president of Digital Lantern, or as we say here in Quebec City, Lantern Digital. Our enterprise is based in Canada and has the mission to provide its client, innovators of the manufacturing and scientific field, with compelling imagery in 3D animation in order to help them develop their businesses. Simply put, we bring our client the technology of cinema and game industry so that they can promote their innovations. We create 3D imagery, 3D animation videos, and provide real-time presentation tools to our client. But more on that shortly. We've been doing this now for 20 years and have clients all around the world. In Canada, the US, in Europe, and Japan. So how did it start? Well, as you can imagine, it started with me. Uh, when I was younger, had I had my way, had I had more confidence, uh, I would probably have pursued a career in movie, in the movie industry or visual effects. But being in Quebec City, didn't have a lot of resource at the time. There was no social media, no uh, internet as we know it today. So resources were really scarce in the field. So I turned myself in a, uh, toward a field where I found myself to be, I thought I would be, uh, uh, where my talent would be more useful, uh, which I was great in drawing, so I went into architecture. So. A couple of years later, I finished my degree in architecture and started working as an apprentice in an architecture firm. Three months later, though, I realized that, well, I realized I didn't, really didn't like my job. If I liked the creation and design processes, there was too many limitations for my taste and I didn't feel fulfilled in the field. After a little bit of soul searching, let's say, I realized my earlier passions were still there and I decided that it would be better to pursue those passions rather than anything else. Being in architecture, I was already working with 3D softwares, and I really liked to work with 3D technologies. I was good and proficient with those tools, and they already were a part of the DNA of my design process. That part of the job where I could bring a project to life really spoke to me. Furthermore, being raised in the 80s, I was of course a big science fiction fan, uh, and I had to develop a real passion uh, for everything that was visually stunning. So, when it came time to illustrate something, I had a lot of inspiration to go to. 3D animation was a perfect way to align my knowledge with my passions. After all, 3D animation has an incredible potential and can be used for so much more than just video games. It literally has no limits and does not suffer the constraint of reality. So for me, it became clear rather quickly that it would be the center of my career. So I returned to school and finished a specialization in 3D animation and then created Lanterne Digital. At first, the company oriented its operation toward real estate developers of the region, the field I knew and was comfortable with. We worked hard and slowly but steadily, as our work got recognized for the quality of the imagery we provided, we expanded to other fields. And soon, not only were we working in real estate, but in the furniture industry, marketing, in pharma, science and technologies, as well as other fields. But when we got the chance to work in the tech industry and its many innovators, that's when our talents start to shine. When we could use all the potential of our trade, that's when we truly found our passion, our mission, our why, helping innovators promote their ideas. In 2013, the studio began to completely orient its service toward innovators of tech and industrial fields. And from then on, our team grew and soon accumulated under its belt more than 3,000 small and big projects. Our many collaborations with our innovating customers inspired us toward a solution-oriented mindset. And as we saw them grow, so did we. We owe a lot to our customers. Their drive inspires us, and it's with that drive, that mindset, that we got into the advent of COVID-19 with all its challenges. The sudden need for our customers to be able to present their product remotely was quickly felt. And this, not without a certain feeling of panic. For many, it was a considerable issue, and few of them were ready for the situation. Some envisioned incredibly complicated solutions, and others, lacking the necessary tools, saw only an impasse. While talking with a lot of our customers, hearing all the means they were ready to take, all the efforts that they were ready to put in, a realization came to us. There should have been a more simpler solution and a more accessible one. And not only for the big guys, but for the small one also. 
a solution that would not only solve the constraint of the pandemic, but which would remain relevant once it was over. This is how the idea of our project was born, the Lantern 3D space. An online platform allowing our customers to be able to present all the advantages of their product, regardless of conditions, with maximum freedom. Being knowledgeable in 3D technologies, the development of this solution was rather quick. From dedicated servers, our customers can now present their innovation in real time. All their features, all their configurations, all their benefits as a tool for sales or formation, in one-on-one -on -one meetings, during trade shows, or to the entire world, from anywhere to anywhere, with the customizable environment of their choice. As I said, we owe a lot to our customers. Their leadership in innovation pushed us to innovate. With this solution, we truly hope to help all kinds of innovators and help the expansion of knowledge all around the world. I hope you liked this presentation. Thanks for listening. Have a good one.